We are here at the Pentecostals of Cooper City, and we wanted to know what God has done in the year 2017, and God has done so much. So we're gonna go around asking people, what have, what, how, how has God answered the prayers that they've been praying for in a segment we're calling God Answers Prayers in 2017. Praise God, POCC. This is one of the Ricketts family, AJ and Melissa. We just wanted to uh, do this video and say how blessed we are for 2017. It's been a great year. Um, the Lord, several times this year, we had instances where we just, uh, not that we tried God, but we said, Lord, you know, we want to see a couple things happen for our family. We're going to put it in your hands. And we said, you know, these are the things that we're seeking after. If you would give it to us or if you would show us your will. And several times this year, I think he's just proved himself in specific detailed ways and just reminded us that he's in control and we can trust him. And we put our faith in his hands and we're just so thankful for his blessings. We have healthy family, extended family. We love our church and we're just happy to be here. God bless everybody. Praise God. God answers my prayers every day. He keeps me healthy. He continues to bless me in every way. He meets my every need every day. And I just thank God for all the things that he's given me that pertains to life and the godliness. My family is blessed and we just a blessed people. And I just thank God for it. Hallelujah. Very grateful to be in the Pentecostals of Cooper City and everything that the Lord has been doing. Um, been praying for family and friends and I see how the Lord has been working with them throughout the year. And I have especially a person who I've been uh, talking about the Lord and she just called me three days ago and um, asked me about the Lord and so so God is doing great things. I wish you guys a Merry Christmas and that His miracles and His love reign in your hearts. Thank you. My name is Adrian, Adrian Fernandez. And I just want to share with you a prayer request that I, um, that I received. Uh, brother in the Lord blessed me with a car. I was been, I've been praying for it for a long time and uh, brother in the Lord just came over and said, Hey, Adrian, I have a uh, I have something to tell you and I went over to his house and he invited me over to his home and he told me, listen, um, I just want to bless you with these keys and uh, it was a Toyota Corolla, it's a 2002, but it gets me to point A to point B and God has blessed me and it's been able to be a blessing to somebody else too where I'll be able to pick up people and it's been awesome, awesome. So just keep the faith, keep on being persistent, God would answer your prayers. Brandon Ramirez, and this year, some around the fi final months of um, 2017, God answered my prayer of trying to get my grades up, or else I wouldn't have a Christmas. That would be very bad for me. Thankfully enough, he answered my prayer, and now look at me, my phone, my Christmas is back, and I'm getting a Nintendo Switch. Hallelujah. I'm so thankful that God has been so great to us. It has always been my desire to move to the great state of Florida. And God has made every provision for me that I was able to relocate in the month of August and have my beautiful family with me. I'm also praying that God will be able to move them here with me permanently. So, and I've always been looking for a great church. And God has blessed me that he has placed me here with a great church, great people, and I really and truly enjoy it. And there is so much I could say, but I just want to give God thanks. God bless you. Praise the Lord Church, this is Amar's family. Our prayer was for our oldest son, Ian, who had experienced some hearing loss. Uh, we're proud to report that uh, against the uh, doctor's thoughts, uh, he has not experienced any further degrading of his hearing, but is actually stabilized. 2017 has been a really hard year at some point. My house flooded on July 14th from a broken pipe. I haven't been back into my house since then they're doing work on it and then on august the 4th i mailed my bills and a few things and tripped and broke my arm and it in three places had to have surgery and a stainless steel uh, plate put in my arm but i have a wonderful church that prays for me and i went through the surgery 
went home, didn't take any pain pills, never had any pain prescriptions filled. And God has taken care of me. My, our state paid us money for the repairs. My family has taken over and doing the labor and the work themselves. My house is totally re going to be brand, like brand new when I do get into it. So sometimes things that start off hard and you wonder, why, Lord, is this happening? God can turn it around and make it beautiful and wonderful. And I want to thank God for Brother Sister Hannibal, all the ministry and the saints of this church. We are so blessed. And I love and appreciate everyone and wish everybody a wonderful, happy, blessed 2018. God bless you all. So we just heard all those awesome testimonies of what right. God, incredible testimonies. Life changing. Life changing, really. No, right. it really was. It is. No, it yeah. really is. And we just want to know what you have to say. Leave a comment below. How has God blessed you this year in the year 2017? And guess what? 2018 is going to be? Greater. Greater. Even better. Incredible. Incredible. Life changing. Life changing. Awesome. Amen. <laughs>